Hey guys, it's Sarah from the Simple Life of Sarah. For this week's video, I'm doing a room tour. So let's get on with the video. Let's go. Welcome to my room. Dun, 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 dun. So to start, we have my nightstand. It's pretty basic. Just have an A-L-A-X-A. Sorry, can't say the name in front of her. And then I just have some plants and just a little bedside table organizer. Hi. And beside it, I have my bed. I just add some plants and some pumpkins. And then, yeah, pretty much the same. I have the same usual pillows and stuffed animals on there. And then turning this way, we have some art pieces I've done before. This one has been a couple of tutorials I followed online. And that one's just kind of abstract. And we have my whiteboard. Sometimes I'll bring YouTube video I brainstorm YouTube videos ideas on it. And then we have my light box. It just says welcome to my room. Wait. And there's a little switch right beside it. I actually got this from the dollar store for like four bucks and I think it's a really good deal. Just some basic stuff and animals up there. The bunny's cheeks are supposed to um, grow more pink once you rub them, but doesn't seem to be working. Then we have just a little area with some like basic little items I like to display, including a signboard. And then we have my shelf where I'll usually do like I'll sometimes do my hair here and there's that and then coming down we have my many rows of books I prefer to have them the other way around I just like the look of it and at the bottom we have the Harry Potter magical capsules and coming back up I actually sort all of them by type so like over here I'll have my favorite books then I have like romance, that's friendship books, humor books, stuff like that. And coming on over, we have my dresser and my art box. That also has my belt. And this is where I put my Winnie the Pooh collection and my Harry Potter magical capsules. I just put some rocks to fill it on top. I think it just looks really good. And coming on over again, we have just two of my favorite stuffed animals. One box of just random notebooks. And a box of even more random things. And then some more stuffed animals. And then one of my many Harry Potter shelves. I'm Harry Hermione. Some of the potions I made in one of my other videos. Go check that out if you want to know how to make them. And then this is Ginny Weasley's wand, and I got it at Universal Studios in LA. There's more Harry Potter things, and a unicorn snow globe, which looks like that. It's really pretty. And just some basic accessories like hair ties. Headbands, bracelets, and then I have more books. These books are organized by series. So you have like the Royal Doll series, the Mysterious Benedict Society series, Dream Dogs, Rainbow Magic, the Candy Makers. And then that's those two rows. And then coming to the very bottom, we have my Harry Potter shelf. Yes, I am missing the fourth book, because that, and that's because I'm rereading it right now. And I have some just fun books. Like, I have a, a Honey Dukes book, and it's actually a scented one. Just some basic ones. And this is one of my favorite things ever. Because it is a pop-up Harry Potter book. 
pretty fragile, but it's super duper duper cool. And then there's so many pop-up things. Then we have like Hogsmeade, the Forbidden Forest, yeah. And you can also spread the whole thing out to make one giant scene. We have a little Harry Potter um, Hogwarts that actually lights up. And a music box. That plays the theme song. See, that is super cool. Then we have the last thing in here is my mirror. This is what I usually use to also get ready in the morning. And then my string lights. This is an adorable cactus photo. So this is my room. So I hope you enjoyed today's video. And if you did, please leave a like and subscribe and comment down below what you want to see for a future video. Until then, bye guys!